Danielle getting all those celebrities tonight. We look forward to that. Well, we want to tell you about a mother in Florence who received the gift of life right now. She needed a kidney transplant, but she could have never predicted the person who would be her donor. News 19's Alexa Harley has her incredible story. At eight years old, Anne Marie Carney was diagnosed with Alport syndrome, a rare genetic disorder characterized by kidney disease, hearing loss, and eye abnormalities. At eight years old, how do you process such heavy information about your health? I remember being in the room, and I remember the doctor telling that to my parents, and I remember my parents being worried. They never, they never acted like there was anything I couldn't do. You know, I, I played all the sports, I did all the things, and that mindset probably kept me from just identifying with an illness. Carney knew that before she was 30, she would need a kidney transplant. A couple of years ago, I guess, I entered stage five kidney failure. And by age 32, she needed that kidney transplant. And the donor was someone she knew. My longtime best friend from elementary school, her husband is the one who gave me the kidney. Yeah, it was kind of crazy how it happened because I got to the point where I was needing to start dialysis and I had an operation done to put an access called a fistula in my arm on January 29th. That was a Monday. Wednesday night, Forrest and his wife Catherine call me and tell me that he has been completely approved to donate his kidney to me and be a direct donor for me. Forrest and his wife Catherine were already considered family by the Carneys, but now that relationship is even deeper. And Forrest was such an advocate for me at Vanderbilt. I just will never be able to thank him enough um, for going out of his way like he did. He didn't have to do what he did. There is so much that she is excited for. Anne Marie knows that she can be more active and present as a mother, and she also has her eyes set on a medal. The first thing I want to do is uh, I want to go compete in the transplant games. <laughs> There's all these different categories of events. You can do badminton and cornhole and golf. My uncle's had a kidney transplant too, and I've been texting him telling him I'm going to start practicing playing golf. So that golf in three months. So <laughs> with that. Yes, with that. In Florence, Alexa Harley, News 19. So those transplant games will take place in a few months in Birmingham, so hopefully Anne-Marie can get a couple rounds in on the golf course beforehand. We wish her all the luck.